The gifts that we can give our children is this cultural awareness about the world and also to let them know that beauty and goodness still exist in the world. Everything artistic that we do is blended with an academic intention. So we do what is natural for children. Children love to move, children love to play, children love to discover. We know that if we write something, draw something, move to something, we are more likely to remember it. The way in which we teach science and math is completely different. Okay, so one plus one is two. Two plus two is four. In geometry, they start studying Euclidean geometry in fifth grade, and they start to draw the geometrical figures with a compass first before they learn the theorems, so that they have an imagination built and an idea around what those shapes look like in their mind before they learn the theorems that actually go along with them. Because we blend the arts with academics, many parents, you know, question, are we academically rigorous enough to prepare their child for high school? In talking to high school teachers, they are blown away when a Waldorf child comes into their class at how engaged and how inquisitive they are about the material. They have two language classes through the week. They um, have two classes of Spanish, two classes of German. Handwork, which um, my kids say that's their favorite, favorite class where they learn these skills, starting with knitting in first grade, going into purling in second grade, third grade, going into crocheting, fourth grade, cross stitch, all the way up through eighth grade when they're using machines. But they also um, then take up instruments and start um, orchestral instruments in third grade, so starting with violin. In our Early Childhood Center, teachers are really on a coalition to protect childhood, um, to really allow children to be children, to allow them to play outside, to explore, to work with their hands. I remember having a conversation with a person on an airplane and um, this person had been dating a person who had gone to a Walter school and she said the most amazing thing about this young man is that he always just fixes things. If a button falls off his shirt, he just fixes it. If there's something wrong with the plumbing, he figures out a way to do that. <laughs> so it's, it's like nothing just stops him. He just feels like he's in charge of, he has his own agency about his life and he can just take care of things. Waldorf Education strives to give students a well-rounded education so that they will be knowledgeable about the world, have superb academic skills, have the ability to think clearly and creatively, and maintain a reverence for life. Waldorf students are recognized by their developed sense of compassion, integrity, and respect for fellow human beings.